Hello to all watching. I know this is something a little bit different from what I'm known for of Steven Universe or Total Drama by this point. Though this is something that I have been wanting to talk about for some time, and I feel now's the time to do it. So, with the ending of Adventure Time not too long ago, many can tell that a new era of cartoons and animation is coming pretty soon. And I say that why? Well, because of, well, Adventure Time again, and also the soon-to-be ending of other shows later within the years, if not months at best. Steven Universe, I know that the next season of Star Versus is supposed to be the last, possibly. Gumball is supposed to be ending pretty soon as well. And funny enough, I would also bet that Teen Titans Go might only have another year or two with it at best. And I'm pretty sure that the creators and writers know this as well, knowing that they've pretty much won. And what I mean by that is that they actually actually managed to pull out the act of having a theatrical movie have people, including those who don't care much for the show and downright hate it, actually come out of the movie and say, you know what? That was a pretty good movie. It was okay, I suppose. That's the peak. Like, where do you go from there? Maybe a sequel? But I don't think they'll really do that. There's no need, almost. So, this begs the question. What's next then? Well, seeing the official and coming soon to be ending of many of the modern cartoons of this era at the back of 2010, already by 2017 and one could say by 2016 even, there was already a shift in cartoons. Shows were being rebooted, failed, others were just plain comedies that were okay and others were pretty good, and then the C-list choice of Netflix shows and then pilots that barely see the light of day. So, does this mean the cartoons will never be the same again as they were 20 years ago? Yes, but I also do believe that cartoons are not dying, of course. There will always be a select handful that are watchable. You might have to go out of your way to find them and watch them, and actually try and enjoy them as much as possible, but they'll be there. They'll always be there. They're just waiting. Many would say that comedies will be taking over the next era, and that they will only be the type of cartoons and shows to air, non-stop with no variety per se. I say that there are your action shows that are still out there and are coming later in the future. A slightly different flavor than what you're used to, but still all the same. Different ones that come with some mystery and story elements added in there as well, and I know some are looking forward to it as well, like with Infinity Train and Young Justice. Thank fucking god. I find it fascinating really, I always do wonder what the next Powerpuff Girls will be, or the next Ed and Eddie, the next Adventure Time, or Gravity Falls, hell, even to some extent the next Teen Titans Go. The new show that'll start the new age of cartoons, and I can tell that it's coming pretty soon, or at least I'm getting pretty old. And whether or not people welcome it with a smile and positive attitude or not will ultimately decide if it's going to be good or not to begin with. So, for the next generation, I hold my head up high and see the positives of the next era. But another question that could be linked to this is, will you? I know this is a bit of a melancholy type video, but hey, at least I made a video, right? Oh well, I try. So, that's that's all I pretty much wanted to say, just given my thoughts of like, what would be the next cartoon that would just change everything? You know, once we hit 2020, what's gonna be like the next show that just starts it all off? The biggest boom, and the one that will have people talking on the internet for, and not actually say ranting about it over some art style or whatever LGBT representation happened that week. Something that people can actually sit down and say like, hey, this was pretty good, I recommend it to other people. I want to know what that next show is going to be. Nothing that's a reboot, nothing that's exactly a tie-in per se, just something original and new. I know by this point it's going to be pretty hard to do something like that, and if anything, ironically, as much as people want something new, it's almost like when they get something new, they just completely complain about it and say like, oh, I don't want this, is bleh. bleh. I was like, well, it's either that or you have your 50 other reboots that you will also complain about. So take what you can, man. So yeah, that's all I pretty much wanted to talk about. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Like what type of show do you think would be perfect that'll 
kickstart the next generation and waves of cartoons that will soon follow trend because you know each like era one show just kind of does it or like a couple of them will do it and then a trend will just start setting off cartoon network did it with like some of their action anime type shows and then within this current era with like adventure time and a bit of regular show with like some story elements added into it uh not entirely episodic but on the comments below let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, or any other discussion topics you guys want me to talk about, I'll try to answer them the best I can. All the links that I provide, uh, some fan art on screen again from my friend that I mentioned last video on YouTube, that should be the link that I leave. Also check out my second channel, and if you go to any of them, tell them I sent you there. Uh, thank you for watching, it's greatly appreciated. Have a great day, have a great night, and everything else you know what to do. Bye.